I just finished running a lot of microphones and a lot of cables, and so I wanted to have a way to test everything out, and I found these online, and I just wanted to share it with everybody else. So here we go. All right, just a little about this Sound Tools XLR cable sniffer. You'll notice right away it is amazing. I love the classiness of it. It feels like a satin box. It is really classy. I put this in my tool bag right away. You open it up, you'll see the sniffer and the sender. Get a load of those there. It also comes with this XLR sniffer sticker that you can put on your sniffer. You can wrap it around there and that's what they recommend doing so that you could know what each one signals. Whether you're installing new equipment or working with older equipment, you're always going to run into a situation where you've run a cable and you have no idea which one goes where, especially when it comes to microphone cables. So microphone cables, when you're running a bunch of them at one time, and you want to find out if nothing is labeled, you want to find out which one goes to which. If you're working with an older setting, like let's say you've inherited a setup and you go in there and especially if you're in a church and you're trying to find out which cable goes to which microphone, to which jack, to which stage box, it's easy with this tool. You can also find out if the cable is good or if the cable is bad. So I'm going to go ahead and plug this in so the lights will illuminate letting you know if the cable is good or bad and because it gives you a light on both ends of the cable it works great it works really well uh, if you're working with a snake you can just take the sniffer you just plug it into each port of the snake and if it has phantom power turn the phantom power on first and it'll let you know which of those are good and which of those are bad it's helped me a lot because um, some of the cabling I've inherited some of the cabling I've installed myself and of course, once you sniff everything out and make sure the cables are good, you know then if you need to run a new cable or if you can just label what you have. And I, of course, recommend labeling everything. That way you know exactly which cable is which later on and you don't have to go through the whole process again. But I believe every AV guy, every tech guy that's working with audio should have one of these in their tool bag. And so I encourage you to get it if you don't have one and it will save you a lot of time, save you a lot of headaches, save you a lot of money in the long run because time is money. Hopefully this will save you some time and I'll put a link in the description below that way you can purchase it as well. They are not sponsoring me. Nobody is sponsoring this channel. My sponsorship is my viewers by you watching this channel. So if you like this, blah, blah, blah. so if you dig this sort of content, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and you can hit the notification bell. That way you know when I've posted a new video and that would help the channel out immensely. Hope you have a great day. See you in the next one.